She said plan wars. You've been waiting a couple of years. Fighting wins is finally here. How did we make that super clear? Yep, we got plan wars. Now you got plan wars! Clash of clans. Prepare for clan wars. Download for free. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hollywood Shono here, along with Hot Stuff, about to give you another Clash of Clans video. In this video, we show off some attacks and defenses <coughs> amongst our clan members, as Jenny's copy. We're going to first start off with Hollywood Shono against Johnny. And right away, we can see that one of the air defenses on the right is unprotected. So we lightning spell the one air defense. Sending the Barbarian King to take out the second air defense. Then we Zerg Dragons in the middle, knowing that only about two of them will go down to the air defense. To take out the two camps. That air defense is massacred, and there are still at least eight dragons up to decimate the rest of the field. Another balloon is popped. And we got some archers in play. All of them get massacred by one dragon. That's why it's a nice toss up between dragons and wizards as far as playing defense. That's my two favorite options. Well, there's still eight or nine dragons left in play. As Jenny is watching on that screwball, as the barbarian king is smoke. Yeah. Oh, we get the perfect on Johnny, who is a town hall eight, forty-four thousand gold elixir, eighty dark elixir, eleven dragons, one barbarian king, three lightning spells. In our next video, we are going to show hot stuff. Getting the win on defense, take note that Hot Stuff was attacked early on and got two star. And we also noticed that Hot Stuff defended and took a one star. We're going to show the 32% victory as I have been toying around with her base. Notice how the layout is similar to mine. We start off with an Archer or Lightning spell on the Town Hall, which was retarded. <laughs> and we got some Clan Giants out. But the mortar does a lot of damage to the barbarian. And a lot of barbarians and archers are low. That mortar does quite a bit of damage. Now we got a bunch of giants in play. The archers are taking out the gold and the mortar. And we got a spring trap on at least two or three giants. There's a bunch of archers in play. However, the mortar takes out over half of them. And the wizards are getting pinged off by the archer tower. Well, the wizards get decimated before the mortar goes down. And all that's left up is one wizard and two giants. And the wizard is going after the gold. It looks like two giants left. And the giant cannot get through the wall. <laughs> so Hot Stuff gets a defensive win in Clan Wars, and that is huge. And Lulus failed big time. Now we're going to show off some clan member replays. We're going to start off with Sausage Fest against Dominant the Beast. Oh, that's a stupid name. As we can see, two air defenses on the left, unprotected. And balloons do get in play. And they do take a crap on those air defenses. Now with all the balloons grouped up, the wizards will decimate all the balloons. And there's... Looks like five or six dragons in play. 
no air defense up. This is going to be an easy 100%. As the Barbarian King stares like an idiot, unable to do anything. And a Rage Spell drop. And the better use of the Rage Spell there would have been to use it on the Balloons, as they are slow units. I was pretty academic at this point, and with a bunch of stuff in the middle, it does still get to view. Looks like something got destroyed. There's a large bottom by the town wall. And we got a couple of archers to take out the camp. A couple of archers are smart on some buildings because you never know when they're going to place stuff out, and the dragons have to waste time on it. That's a big fail. We got a Barbarian King out to eat as he destroys the Barbarian. And the Barbarian King is aggro and he's about to get burnt out. There looks to be about four dragons left. Plus the Barbarian King and there's a few archers up. We got one camp left. Well, Sausage Fest gets the 100% after a bunch of balloons get decimated early on. Still having six dragons, no clan castle, and three rage spells. And take note that balloons benefit from the rage spell the most as they are very slow units. Now we're going to show Sir Kuyalix, our leader, against Ramen. And that almost sounds like one of the Chicago White Sox players today. As we see, there are two air defenses in decent position. Oh, there's some plain barbarians and archers. They look like level 5. Six. Breaking through on the west. And we got more wall breakers. A bunch of wall breakers coming in at once. And they do get in through the middle. Now the healers are in play. And the heal spell right before the giants go down. And a rage spell. Well placed right in the middle of this thing. Oh, we got some wizards out. That'll take out the side really quick. That's a couple giants getting ejected. Oh, we got some wizards down below, a barbarian down below. And another healer did not save that wizard. And a seeking air mine takes out one of the healers. The other air defense is about to go down by the giant. So the healer should step. And a clan level 3 dragon comes into play. Even if the healer and the other troops are down, academic at this point. We see Builder Hunt in the corner. Well, we're at 94% and a wizard takes out the Builder Hut. And Sir Kudelix, our leader, gets three stars on ground and using a bunch of random troops. However, got the job done. Nicely played, boss. Now we're going to show an attack from X Vision Gaming on Skiller Killer 23. And there are two air defenses. And a bunch of minions off the east as the archers work on them. And this looks like a minion dirt. We got some balloons to distract the minions and a rage spell well placed to take out an air defense. I haven't seen a minion search before, so this is actually rather interesting. And now some minions from the clan castle and a barbarian king. So hopefully distract the archers and the wizards, and it doesn't look like it. Oh, well, the other air defense is down, and there are a couple balloons up with about a dozen minions. And the wizard tower is distracted from the barbarian. So a heal spell. It looks like it does affect balloons. And the barbarian king is down. A bunch of minions still up. So X Vision Gaming gets 100% on Skiller Killer 23 with a very interesting strategy. 70 minion, 10 level 4 balloons, Barbarian King, 1 rage spell, and 2 level 2 heals. 
a very interesting play there. Now we're going to go into our clan wars. We're going to go near the top of the map. As Vader has one star and only did do an attack for one star. But we're going to try to get a better score. The main thing I noticed from this base is that off to the left is a fairly weak air defense. And we're going to lightning the bottom air defense. So our next strategy is to send the Barbarian King in and five Wizards and hope that is enough to get rid of the air defense as one of the Wizards gets ejected. Unfortunately, the Wizards are not doing so well. But we're going to send some Giants in. It looks like the clan defense is in. But they do break through. The Barbarian King is still up. And the air defense is knocked out, so we're going to send all nine dragons in. Hopefully they go after the air defense. As Jenny watches on. We are live with this video. This is not recorded, pre-recorded. There's still a good seven dragons up. Two archer towers, two wizard towers on defense remain. Dragon buff. So using the Giants and the Wizards and Barbarian King did work as planned. And the Big Cheese, you owe me apology because you thought I would get home? Guess what? You're wrong. I love proving people wrong because I am Hollywood Shono and I am the master of clan wars and let me just start off right now, there are no breaks. Learn how to play the game. I do have a minute and twelve seconds left and a builder hut way off to the north, untouched. Now we're with a minute and four seconds left, we shouldn't have a problem getting hundred percent. And one dragon is knocked out. So we have the town hall and two builder huts left. 47 seconds, it should not be a problem at all. Hopefully one of the dragons go the other way. They all go the other way, but we have 38 seconds left, so I don't see this being a problem. And like the abominations in StarCraft 2, random terror. Oh, so the builder hut goes down. And we have 25 seconds to get to the other Builder Hut. Go, go, go. <laughs> go, Dragon, go fly. <coughs> and the Builder Hut is there, so we get the three-star victory on Vader. And the Big Cheese can eat his mouth, as he doesn't know who he's dealing with. So we get the three-star victory on Vader, as somebody thought I could not get it done. So if you like this video live after the Detroit Tigers game with hot stuff on live commentary, please give this video a like rating, comment, subscribe, share this video amongst your friends, add as a favorite, check out my other Clash of Clans videos, my playlist, my Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, which are all Hollywood Shono. And House Quilix is probably going to lose this war. Have a wonderful day, kids. <laughs> I don't think so. Like, this is my buff. <laughs> I don't think so. I doubt it. We already lost. www.youtube.com slash Hollywood Show now. Subscribe, bitches!